Huawei is once again making headlines with its push towards self-reliance in smartphone hardware. The latest buzz out of China suggests that the company is actively developing not one, but two new CIS camera sensors, potentially game changers, for its upcoming flagship, the Mate 80 series. A trusted Weibo tipster digital chat station recently revealed that Huawei is currently working on two advanced CIS contact image sensor camera sensors. These new sensors aren't just another upgrade. They're part of Huawei's larger plan to reduce its dependency on foreign technology and establish more self-developed components across its devices. This move follows earlier rumors hinting that the Pura 80 Ultra would feature a self-developed camera setup. Now it seems that the Mate 80 series is also on track to receive this cutting-edge camera tech. So, what exactly is a CIS sensor? A contact image sensor is a compact, cost-effective lens system known for high-resolution output and consistent illumination. It captures images line by line as an object moves, making it excellent for fast scanning and precision imaging. These sensors are typically used where speed and accuracy are essential, and Huawei is now bringing them into the smartphone world. Let's break down the two new sensors Huawei is reportedly working on. First up is the SC5A0CS. This is the E, same camera sensor that's rumored to be used in the Pura 80 Ultra. It features a 1-inch 50-megapixel sensor and uses RYYB color filter technology. RYYB, which stands for Red, Yellow, Yellow, Blue, is a unique color filter array developed by Hua, way to boost light intake, especially in low-light scenarios. By replacing green pixels with yellow ones, this filter significantly enhances light sensitivity, resulting in better overall image quality, more detail in shadows, and more natural colors, even in challenging lighting conditions. The second. Sensor is a brand new development, the SC5 NIMOXS. Like the first, it also carries a 50 megapixel resolution, but with a slightly smaller 1 or 1.3 inch sensor size. It also adopts RYYB technology and may serve as a periscope lens in future Huawei flagships. This makes it suitable for advanced zoom capabilities, likely enhancing telephoto performance. What sets this sensor apart, however, is its support. For Huawei's new SuperPix Gain HDR 2.0 technology, a feature that could redefine smartphone photography. SuperPix Gain HDR 2.0 is a major leap forward in dynamic range capabilities. It supports up to 140 dB of ultra-high dynamic range, which is impressive by any standard. Using a unique method that combines a single pixel with overflow charge storage, essentially blending three frames into one exposure, this tech significantly boosts both light sensitivity and the signal-to-noise ratio. In simple terms, your pictures will come out clearer, more detailed, and better exposed, even in high-contrast scenes like sunsets or backlit portraits. But that's not all. SuperPix Gain HDR 2.0 also addresses common photography issues such as optical crosstalk and chromatic aberration. It minimizes distortion, enhances clarity, and delivers more accurate colors. Plus, it's designed with power efficiency in mind, offering low power consumption while still delivering top-tier imaging performance. It even features LED flicker suppression, ensuring that artificial lights in your shots won't create unwanted flickering or banding effects. Together, the SC5A0CS and SC590XS sensors represent a significant technological leap. The former brings a large sensor and improved light sensitivity for general photography, while the latter could push zoom and HDR performance to new heights. If these sensors do make it into the Mate 80 series, and possibly the Pura 80 Ultra, we could be looking at some of the most advanced smartphone cameras on the market. It's important to note that Huawei hasn't officially confirmed the existence of these new sensors yet. However, the company's recent trends toward in-house development strongly support the idea. With the increasing challenges of working with foreign suppliers, especially in the face of global trade restrictions, Huawei appears determined to go fully self-reliant, and these camera sensors could be a major step in that direction. For now, we'll have to wait and see how things develop. But one thing is certain, if these leaks are accurate, the Huawei Mate 80 series could set a new benchmark for smartphone photography thanks to a pair of homegrown sensors designed for performance, precision, and next-level image quality. Stay.
Tune for more updates as we get closer to the official announcements.